So we've had some questions about where the returned section on Google Classroom is now located. Um, and we looked into it and we have found out what has been changed in Classroom that causes this. So this is an assignment that I've done here and it is out of four points. I have a lot of people who haven't turned it in and then I have one person who did turn it in and I assigned a score. So my two groups here now are graded and assigned. If uh, I did not actually want to have a grade for this assignment, if it was just something that was formative, but I left the score up here at the default of 100, then this is what you're going to see no matter what. You'll only have a graded section and an assigned section. And if you go into here and you change the student work, so if this one is not actually set as a four, but it's just blank, so maybe you went in, you read the paper, and you just returned it without applying a score, then the actual status of that assignment for the student changes to missing instead of something like returned. So when I come back here, now I have no graded assignments, which makes sense. Technically, nothing has been graded. Uh, so they're all labeled as missing. So how do you solve this? Well, if you are actually going to do something that is ungraded, you need to switch the assignment to being ungraded. Now, in this example, uh, I am it was graded, and I'm going to go ahead and switch it, so I would do it from here. But when you create this, the assignment to start with, uh, you have a section where you can choose whether or not you're going to put points in or if you're going to set it as ungraded. So just know now moving forward that if you want to have a returned section, then you're going to have to have an ungraded assignment. Otherwise, your two categories are going to be assigned and graded. If it's ungraded, you'll have assigned and returned. So hopefully that helps.